G'day guys, Tommy here at Raw Bland. Today I'm going to make for you a brand new recipe, uh, great for entertaining. This is my new eggplant dip, uh, or an aubergine dip, uh, depending on where you come from. So today I'm using the new Vitamix Professional Series 300 model. This is my favorite new Vitamix model to use. Uh, you'll notice I'm using the 900ml container. This is perfect for making smaller quantities like dips. Uh, you can buy this as an add-on, all right? So I'm gonna start, I've got 360 grams of grilled eggplant. Um, you can roast it if you like, um, but raw eggplant's not gonna taste great in this dip, okay? So it has to be a grilled eggplant. Um, I'm just gonna put that in. So eggplant's really, really good for you. Um, it's high in fiber, it's low in cholesterol, and it's also an excellent brain food. Um, it's really high in antioxidants, okay? So 360 grams, in we go. I've got some lovely tahini here, all right? Super nutritious. You can just buy that at the uh, local supermarket um, or you can make it yourself in the Vitamix, of course. I'm putting in just about two tablespoons of tahini. Some nice uh, organic hull tahini we've got. And then I'm gonna squeeze in a whole lemon, all right? So just put it through my fingers like this, just so I don't get any of those seeds in there. And the other one. So really high in vitamin C. It's gonna give that, uh, the dip a really, you know, zingy uh, flavor. All right, that looks good. And I've got a little bit of garlic, all right? So I have peeled the garlic when I make a dip, because um, I'm just gonna run it on a slow speed, all right? So I peel the garlic. Just about one clove, and then some Himalayan rock salt, and some pepper. All right, I'm gonna keep the seasoning pretty simple. All right, that looks pretty good to me. I'm gonna lock our lid into place, just like so. I'm gonna start it on the slowest speed. I'll probably work it up to about speed four or five. I'm gonna use my tamper. Notice this little tamper holder here, all right? You can buy this um, for your Vitamix, even the uh, classic Vitamix models, this will fit too, okay? So really handy so you don't lose your tamper. And away we go, probably about 30 seconds. That's it, that's how easy it is. So I've let that run for about 30 seconds. You can see the consistency there. Still got those little specks of uh, the grilled eggplant in it. All right, so absolutely beautiful. Um, I don't have any crackers here today, so I'm just gonna try a little bit of this with my finger. Excuse me, mum. I love this recipe. I only came up with it last week. I think you're gonna absolutely love it. Try this at home. Um, I'm gonna garnish that with a little bit of a drizzle of olive oil and some uh, fresh parsley just over the top. Happy blending. Today I'm gonna to introduce to you the Sedona Classic Raw Food Dehydrator. All right, uh, we've actually been using this dehydrator for about five years now. 